William Ifold was the principal librarian in charge of the State Library of New South Wales during and after World War I. He really recognised that soldiers' diaries and letters were going to be really important historical resources uh, for future generations of Australians. The chap has just been brought in and is sitting by my side. Poor devil. His whole body is shaking. His nerves must be shattered. We have around 20 diaries written by stretcher bearers. William Burrell enlisted as a stretcher bearer and he served in France and Belgium. I put a tourniquet on and was bringing a stretcher when a shell landed behind me and blew me down. If we're going to look at experience in the Great War, because often the stretcher bearers are forgotten, it's only when the fighting starts and the soldiers in the trenches and on the battlefield suddenly realise if I'm wounded, these men are going to have my life in their hands. Lost a lot of blood and was very weak, but managed to hobble out. Burrell received his military medal for bravery in the field from continually going back and forward re rescuing men. Well, the value of the diaries is just, it's, it's hard to put a value on them. They're, 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 they're priceless as historical documents, offering up a range of experiences from the Great War that you won't get anywhere else.